welcome to your reading you guys it is the sagittarian goddess I hope wherever you are in the world, you are prosperous and you're having a wonderful day. Know that you are protected and you are divinely guided. Yes. Thank you. Welcome to my YouTube channel, you guys. If you are new, welcome. I hope you subscribe and join the community here. Who do I have the pleasure of meeting with today? Aquarius, Aquarius, welcome Aquarius to your reading, welcome, you're thinking about something, you're thinking about some steps that you have taken, looks like these steps have been a bit difficult but you are making your way, this ace of earth, you are making your way. You're stabilizing yourself. You're balancing yourself. Wow, you're you're becoming more grounded. You're becoming more grounded in your emotions. More stable in your emotions. Beautiful, Aquarius. Lovely. <laughs> Tender repletion for Aquarius. The Ace of Acorns. You could be dealing with the fire sign. Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. You have a lot of passion. You have a lot of confidence going, going towards these steps too. Even though these steps are difficult, you're looking at these steps like what? <laughs> yes, you are focused on your stability. You're focused on maintaining yourself, maintaining your connections. You're being creative. You're having fun. Oh, wow, Aquarius. Wow. Father of water for Aquarius. Thank you, spirit. Wow, this is beautiful. Very mature here. Nine of feathers. Wow. You are self-confident. You are confident. Like you, your self-esteem is high. You feel good. You're you're working on yourself. Like physically, I see you working on yourself as well. Not just emotionally, mentally, and and financially here, but Physically and mentally, it's like you're 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 ready. You're ready for whatever you're you're headed towards here. Basically, you are prepared. Aquarius, wow. You always have such beautiful energy come out, such amazing, like extraordinary energy come come out in my reads here. Very inspirational. Ace of Acorns and Tender Repletion for Aquarius. success like i cannot make this up aquarius wow i'm very inspired you are okay with taking these steps like these steps are very scary for you and you're looking at these steps like okay i can fall in so what i can fall in that water if i don't keep the right balance yes i may i may trip and fall but guess what i'm going to keep going with this ace of acorns here wow i am so <laughs> inspired by this reading aquarius this is the Sagittarian goddess, Aquarius. I hope you are enjoying this beautiful reading of yours. What amazing energy you carry. Equilibrium. You are celebrate like you are literally you are literally celebrating no matter what. You're celebrating everything. Every step you take, you're celebrating it. You count it all. Like you count all of your blessings, you count all of your steps, no matter how big or small they are. You're not playing any games. Look at these people going up this mountain. Like this is this is a hard road to travel and this is a hard road to travel. And you're traveling the road. It's like you don't even care about what what could go wrong. You're thinking about all the things that could go right. You definitely could be connected to a fire sign. Fire sign or another air sign here. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. Wow. The Ace of Earth for Aquarius. 
the tower. Yeah, something something could have happened with your stability here. In the past, you could not you could not have been positive about moving forward. You could not have been, you know, optimistic about the steps that you take in here with this tower on top of this earth. You could have had a hard time with your stability. Like mentally, you could just have been pessimistic about things. You could have had a pessimistic person around you that that showed you all the worst case scenarios here. And you have to find out yourself that even though there are the worst case scenarios out here, even though things could fall down, things could also be good for you. And you're moving in a positive, positive direction. It looks like you have an emotional connection here with someone moving forward as well with this father of water, very mature energy for you. Wow, Aquarius. What a, what a very inspirational reading. Very inspirational, logical thinking. Yeah, you're very, you're very emotionally mature. This is Virgo energy. This is earth. You're very, you're very emotionally mature. Friendly cheer, Libra energy. Yeah, look at you cheering. Look at you dancing. Like you're having a good time. You're enjoying life. You're, you're taking what life brings. Bring, you're taking whatever life brings you and you're making the best out of it. You're free. You're literally free. What does Aquarius' lover want for them to know? Thank you. I try to distract, distract myself, but you're always on my mind. Wow. <laughs> Someone is very attracted, attracted to your energy. They're attracted to this ambition that you have, this positive thinking that you have. I'm sorry for the things that I've said. Yeah, dealing with the love connection, you could have you could have have had a disagreement with someone in a love connection here. They could have said some hurtful things with this nine of feathers, but they they have matured and they apologize for that. I feel that very strongly here. Wow. Aquarius need to know about their love life chemistry yes you have a strong connection with someone here in love or you have the opportunity to have that in love especially with this energy moving forward here very mature energy moving forward you're not playing any games you are serious about you you are serious about you like let your friends help you Yes, you could be dating or you if you aren't already in a romantic connection, you could be looking forward to dating here with this nine of feathers. You could be looking looking to date. So your friends may want to set you up on a date. I'm hearing you could have friends that are wanting to set you up, up, up on blind dates or maybe they're saying that they have someone for you or someone, you know, is interested in you. Or you could have someone saying that, you know, they would want to take you out on a date. I'm hearing someone asking you out on a date. And maybe you're getting the opinion of someone else. But Aquarius, you do not need anyone's opinion on, on what you want. You are very wise here. You have a lot of passion. You are very stable. You you are able to, uh, you have overcome so much and you understand the things that are happening around you. You are celebrating no matter what. You are grateful for your tower moments here. You have the wisdom to know whether or not if you want to try dating someone here. You're in a great energy as well. I'm going to also clarify the tower and the ace of earth for you just to get you a little bit more clarity on this reading on your energy. Aquarius, beautiful. The four feathers rest. Yeah, you may be relaxing. Like you may not even be interested in a love connection. But if you are in a, in a love connection, you and whoever you're connected to are in a state of relaxation. And what I mean by that is that you two have overcome a lot in this relationship. You two have had to take many difficult steps and you have had to had to stabilize yourselves in this romantic relationship. And so now it's time for you two to rest and actually enjoy one another's company. I see you enjoying someone's company here. Wow, Aquarius, this was a beautiful, beautiful reading. This is the Sagittarian goddess and I hope you enjoyed your beautiful reading, Aquarius. I will see you all in the next reading.